I'm here at um, Blaukrens Bridge, ready to do my bungee jump. Apparently it's the world's highest bungee jump from a bridge in the entire world. So, Sam scared would be a vast, vast and horrible understatement. I am shitting bricks right now. But I figure you only live once. It's super cheap here. So, uh, yeah, hopefully I'll see you on the other side. Pray for me. it's Jay just thought I would use this section of the video to let you know what was going through my mind at this particular moment when I felt myself hurtling towards the earth I thought of every single time that my mother had told me to do something and I never listened and I was also thinking of how incredibly cold it was and I was thinking of me just dangling out in the air you can't really tell but I really wish that I'd had my socks on at this point because it was really really windy and I was wearing these loose fitting trousers that I had bought from a market when I was in Turkey earlier in the year realizing what I had just done having essentially been pushed off a bridge because there was no way that I was about to jump off how do you knowing full well that yes you might be secure but how can you just fling yourself off the edge? I could not bring myself to do that. I just, I couldn't. So when they promised that they wouldn't push me and I kept feeling their hands against my back, nudging me along, I kind of figured at this point that they were lying. But when this lovely young gentleman started climbing down to come and retrieve me, I wasn't entirely sure whether I was alive or dead in purgatory like I had no idea what was going on so I just made sure that he was listening to me I held his hand and I basically told him my entire life story I'm like listen listen I need to get my story out there somebody needs to know about the life of Jay like my story cannot just end here me hurtling myself towards the ground when my mother told me expressly not to I'm absolutely glad that I did do it, but when I had done the bungee jump, I was the last one on a Friday, and unfortunately that Friday happened to be Halloween. Now, like I said, I'm not superstitious, but when you're just hanging on by essentially a giant rope over the edge of a bridge, you get a little superstitious, I think. But the Face Adrenaline Company, they're really, really good. I felt, I mean, once I was back on earth and I could feel my feet back on the ground, I felt completely safe and secure. But they absolutely know what they're doing and I would highly recommend them to everyone. 
Hey, this is Jade from Jay on Life. Uh, thanks for watching my video. If you've liked what you've seen, and even if you don't like it, make sure to click subscribe. Uh, you can find me on different social media under Jay on Life. I'm on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and Google+. Be sure to check out more of my stories on my blog, www.jayonlife.com, and I hope to see you soon.